Hey guys, how are you? I'm Kristen, your independent CC consultant, and I have a what am I warming for you video. Funny story, I recorded this entire video already, and I took a little nap, <laughs> and when I woke up, uh, the video still hadn't processed, so I have no idea what went wrong well with that, so trying this again. <laughs> Um, maybe it won't be as long as the last one because I tend to ramble a little bit in the last one. So, um, but I'm awake now <laughs> and we're going to record this again. And we just had a good laugh because on this video recording program that I'm using, I hit the microphone button and it made this crazy loud noise. So my kids and I were like, what in the world? <laughs> Anyways, so let's get to our video. There's not as much today as there was the last time because I either didn't change my warm result every other day like I usually do or um, I just kind of forgot or you know like some of these scents just lasted really well and I just wasn't ready to change them out yet so anyways I have a lot of bring back my bars in this video so a lot of these aren't available and then there's a lot of them that will be available they're just um, fall winter scents that are going to be available in a, wow with our new catalog uh, September 1st so and I will let you know that and I will also let you know what will be retiring so let's get started uh, the first thing that I warmed, I did a combination of coconut cotton and honeymoon hideaway. Now, let's take a little moment for coconut cotton because it's going away. I love this scent. I love anything coconut, um, plain coconut, combinations of coconut with other things. And this is so good because this isn't your typical like when you say cotton it's not like laundry laundry but it is laundry <laughs> but it's just it's like coconut laundry I guess you could say I don't know but it smells so good we have this right now and we have it in our you know everything that scent comes in like bars room sprays scent circles um, car bars um, scent packs and then we have it in our laundry line and our clean line so if you love coconut cotton I recommend you stocking up on it because it's going away after August 31st like I am going to be stocking up on bars um, I know my mom wants me to stock up on them she has a car bar she loves it uh, just anything uh, wash your whiffs come in coconut cotton and they're amazing but after August 31st no more coconut cotton so this is lovely uh, honeymoon hideaway it's just a nice like romantic type um, almost like a fresh beachy scent um, I'll tell you what the scent notes are because this is part of our core collection that usually sticks around um, so honeymoon hideaway is escape to a secluded retreat of dew kissed lily and tart sweet kiwi shaded by lush coconut palm so it's kind of like a nice like light tropical smell so when you pair that with the coconut cotton it is really good together so stock up on coconut cotton and get you some honeymoon hideaway and mix them together they're lovely so that's all in that combination I talked a lot about that one <laughs> Um, another one with coconut is coconut pumpkin pie and this is part of our corner cafe line so this is current and it is really good it's coconut and pumpkin it I actually <laughs> this smells so good I actually looked up a recipe for coconut pumpkin pie never found one but I'm pretty sure it could be done um, I love like I said I love coconut and then I really like pumpkin I'm not one of those everything pumpkin kind of people like in the fall but I do like it and this is a great scent um, so this will be good for the fall but of course you know me I warm whatever during whatever season I don't warm seasonally <laughs> I will warm fall scents right now. I will warm tropical scents in the middle of winter. I don't care. <laughs> so uh, next I did, I warmed country plum. 
Country Plum is not current. Um, I'm not really sure. I'm not sure when it was. I think it was a scent of the month one month. Um, I'm not sure if it was, you know, an actual regular scent, but I think it was a scent of the month. I'm, I don't know. It was before my scent time as a Scentsy consultant. So it's really nice. It's just a nice fruity plum. I'm not really sure what else I smell in it, but it's really good. So that's Country Plum. Um, next, let's see, I warmed Cozy Fireside and I mixed it with Mocha Doodle. So Cozy Fireside, obviously a nice autumn scent. Um, it is coming back September 1st and you smell, I smell apples, I think. I, you can kind of smell, it smells like a fireplace. It smells exactly what it says. So let's see. So it is in the holiday collection and it says, Warm spice notes with zesty ginger and cinnamon. So you definitely smell cinnamon and I guess the spices and all, just the way it is, like it just smells like a fire and, um, you know, like that fireplace. I think it was ski lodge. <laughs> I don't know why. I guess because it smells like a fireplace and my idea of a ski lodge is warm and cozy sitting by the fire. So, and then mocha doodle, I will tell you exactly what that is. It smells like coffee with a hint of chocolate which i guess is you know is obviously what mocha is so it says delicious roasted coffee beans and cocoa balanced with sugar caramel and heavy cream so when you mix the two together it's really good it's like like i got the combination from one of these there's a facebook group um where you get sensi recipes and they called it warm coffee so it's really nice um i liked it in my kitchen it smelled really good so um, and then, let's see, I know it's here somewhere. I warmed Crisp Orchard Air. Now, this one sounds like it's supposed to be fall, but it's actually, I think, in our spring-summer line. It is going away after August 31st. Um, I smell, like, some apples in there. I'm not really sure what else but it smells really good so I mean it sounds like a good fall scent so you know you should pick it up and stock up on it you know I think it's really nice I'm trying to pick up what else is in there but I'm not sure what else it's just like maybe a little bit of vanilla I'm not sure or amber well, let's look it up let's see if I can find my current catalog and I can tell you what the scent notes are in it because it's it's like a good um I guess transition scent, like from summer to fall. Let's see. I know it's in here somewhere. Okay, crisp orchard air. Uh, and I don't know how to say this word. Is it kints or kints or quints? I don't know. Jam crisp. Uh, green apple and sandalwood the sandalwood that's what I'm smelling sandalwood so it's nice I like it um and then I mixed I mixed three different scents together and one of this recipe was actually called uh, caramel pumpkin latte so I started out with and I am going to mess this up, I know. Dulce de leche or dulce de leche? How do you say that? I took Spanish in high school. I did really well with it, but I can't remember if you say dulce or dulce. So, and I know that's just, it's like a caramel with cream kind of scent. Smells so good. It smells like one of those Werther's candies. Um, I love it. Or It's just... I love caramel so and then I mixed it with our mocha doodle that we already talked about and then I also threw in pumpkin roll and pumpkin roll is coming back in the fall like I said I like pumpkin I'm not I don't go crazy with it but I do like this one pumpkin roll is so good it smells exactly like its name so uh, smells just you know if you know what a pumpkin roll is most people do but if you don't it's where you have like the pumpkin spice cake with the uh, cream cheese frosting and you roll it up like a giant Swiss cake roll. So um, that's pumpkin roll. Now, a lot of people wonder why do you have pumpkin roll and pumpkin marshmallow? Well, pumpkin roll is the nice 
cake, um, you know, gourmet scent, um, smells just like dessert. Pumpkin marshmallow smells just like pumpkin. I don't smell any marshmallow in it. It smells just like you cracked open a can of Libby's pumpkin. Um, so that's the difference between pumpkin roll and pumpkin marshmallow. So this one, you know, this particular combination, I used pumpkin roll. And it was so good together. The caramel, the chocolate, coffee, and the pumpkin. It just made for a really nice scent. And I will probably warm that combination again this fall. So that one was really good. Um, next, I warmed Eskimo Kiss and Tahitian Black Orchid. Now, Tahitian Black Orchid is not available. It's an older bar. Um, I smell a little like, I guess plum, and then what smells like a little bit of, like an amber or vanilla. It's, it's really good, um, but it's not current. And then Eskimo Kiss is from the Holiday Collection also, so it's not current now, but will be September 1st. And the scent notes in it, let's see, it's kind of sweet, it like a little bit sweet. Um, it's like something fruity in it. It almost smells like it has a little hint of mint. But the scent notes are blackberry jam, brown sugar, vanilla, and amber. So nothing mint in there at all, but so, but I don't know. I like it. It smells really good, and the two of them together are pretty nice. So, but this one, like I said, you can't get, but this one you can get September 1st. Um, next is a very, very old bar. Um, it's so old. Look at that label and look at the wax. Like it's got, got this coral color to it, but then on the back side, it's like a tan. So if you can see, let's see if you can see it. Probably not. Uh, yeah, you can see it's like a two-tone. It, I don't think that messes with the quality of it. Um, it kind of does give off like a waxy smell. But the scent of it, now, I never smelled French Kiss. I picked this up from somebody. So I don't really know what French Kiss is supposed to smell like. Um, it seems to be a lighter scent. Uh, that could be just because the bar is old. But what I do get out of it... I think it smells really good. Like I warmed it in my bathroom, so um, I don't really know how to describe it either. It's something a slight fruitiness in it, but I don't know. Yeah, I, I like it. It's pretty good, but I don't know. Like I said, I don't know if you know if it's just an old bar or if it's just a light scent. So if you know, if you know what French Kiss is supposed to smell like, let me know. Um, next we had a bring back my bar from June and I am so sad that I did not pick up more of these, but <sighs> smells so good. This is frosted ginger cookie and it smells just like a gingerbread cookie with the icing and everything. It's just really good. Uh, it's so yummy. <laughs> I wish I would have picked up more. So if this ever comes back to bring back my bar again, I will stock up. Um, next is another really old bar and it's German chocolate. Now, chocolate and wax, <laughs> whether it be a candle or this kind of wax, it's tricky. And this is okay. Um, it's definitely chocolate, but it's not like, like I was underwhelmed with it. It's not something that I just would rush to. I think if you mixed it with something, like I just warmed it straight like it is, but I think if you mixed it with like a vanilla or even happy birthday, like I think it would be so good. Like I said, by itself, it was just kind of, <laughs> I love chocolate. I love smelling chocolate, but chocolate and wax form is kind of weird <laughs> so that's that one um next is go go goji and you know i'm guessing it's just supposed to be like a goji berry now i wanted to do an example with this one so if you can see my bar i don't know if you can tell it's kind of like i don't know if you want to call it a juicy bar <laughs> 
or it looks kind of like it's sweating and if you look you can see like it's the scent oils on it if you have bars like that they're okay don't worry about them they're not as long as you store them properly they're not going to leak um, now I have a container that when you put them in the container they're all standing up and so they're like stacked but then when I store them I turn the container on its side because you're supposed to store your bars flat Be and the reason behind that is because they have the scent oils in them and so you don't want all your scent oils to run down to the bottom because then you're not going to get proper scent distribution so make sure you know little side note here make sure you store your bars flat and if they're like this don't worry about them um, they'll be fine but this smells really good um, it very berry fruity scent but it was a bring back my bar in 2016 so it's not available right now um, and then next I put together another bring back my bar from 2016 this is great granita or granada I don't know how you're supposed to say it let me know how you're supposed to say it so that I can get it correct next time. Um, but I mix that with Sunkiss Citrus, which is definitely current, will always be current for, well, I'm not gonna say always because none of these scents are guaranteed to always be back. But um, for right now, yes, this is a classic one. Um, grape Granada, I'm gonna say Granada, that's how a lot of people say it, unless I get corrected, but it smells like grape soda to me. <laughs> I don't know what else this smells like. It just smells like grape. Um, and then mixed with the citrus. The Sunka citrus is really good. It's just a nice citrusy orange smell. I just smell orange. <laughs> um, and they were nice together. They made like a nice little fruit salad, I guess. <laughs> oh, that's actually what the name of it was. The recipe was fruit salad. So, um... I also warmed grapefruit blossom. Now, some people are going to frown at me for this. I hate grapefruit. I think it's awful. I don't know how people can just like dive right into a whole grapefruit and eat it because I'm just like, ugh. Um, <laughs> I, and smelling this makes me think of it. But I mean, this is not bad. It's grapefruit blossom. It's not overly floral, which is good because I don't like a lot of floral, but it's enough floral that it's not just grapefruit. And my computer keeps getting dim. I don't know what's going on there. Oh, I think it's because it's not plugged in. When it's not plugged in, it'll kind of like get dim. So I'm gonna plug it in. All right, so, but grapefruit blossom. Like I said, I do not like grapefruit. I like I can't even drink grapefruit juice. Even the ones that say super sweet, uh, they don't taste anything sweet to me at all. But I like this. This was um, part of Breathe at My Bar back in June. Um, so you can't get it right now. But if it ever comes back, don't be afraid of the grapefruit. <laughs> And don't be like thinking it's going to be like super floral with the blossom because it's not. It's a great, it's a lighter scent, um, but it's nice. So grapefruit blossom. Um, I also took, let's see. Okay. This says Bring Back My Bar 2016. It also has my old consultant's information on it from before I join Cincy. This is happy birthday. This is so yummy. You open it up. It smells like you just made a cake mix. Oh, my nose itches. Okay. Um, but it just smells like when you were a kid and you would like the cake batter beaters that your mom would give you. Just if you stuck your head in the bowl of cake batter, it just smells so good. So happy birthday. I did grab another bar of this when we had Bring Back My Bar, because this did come back for Bring Back My Bar this year. And then I mixed it with Red Candy Apple, another Bring Back My Bar 2016. I didn't remember getting all these Bring Back My Bars in 2016, but apparently I did. So Red Candy Apple, it's not like Apple Press, so don't think anything like that. Apple Press is just that you smell it, it smells like a big old juicy apple. This is what it says it's a candy apple so it's a sweet sugary apple 
and it's pretty good on its own but when you mix it with happy birthday it is so good it's very nice so if either of these come back pick them up and try those and let's see lastly I warmed another bring back my bar for 2016 you know big surprise there it's called happy go lucky I'm not really sure what all is in it it smells really good it smells like some type of like a body spray or like a really sugary sweet perfume um, I'm not really sure exactly what it, I I can smell a little bit of maybe like an amber um, maybe some type of like fruit in it like a like a berry or maybe a plum but it's really good it's this like cute little pinky orchid colored wax um, my camera doesn't pick up the colors very well but it's pretty nice like I like it it rem I know there's a perfume it reminds me of I can't think of it if you can drop it in the comments so that's happy-go-lucky and that is everything so if you um liked any of the combinations try them um if there's something you've been warming that you want to tell me about and you want me to try let me know um also i'm gonna leave my facebook page and my email address uh message me if you would like to i mean we have a lot of new scents coming out in september so if you want to be able to earn some free and half price Scentsy, um, I'll send you one of these. Now this one is full of the spring and summer scents, and which is fine because they are current right now. So I could send this out. I send it priority mail. It'll be at um, where you are in two days. Keep it for about 10 days. Collect orders. Um, if you collect $200 or more in orders, you will get at least one half price item and 10% um, in Scentsy credit. So um, this is a good way to go. I can also do Facebook parties. I could do Facebook live parties. Um, I can just send you some catalogs and order forms and let you collect um, orders that way. Um, so I can party with you even if you're not where I live um, if you are local to me I can do a home party so let's earn you some free and half price Scentsy um, that's those scents I also have the new fall and winter scent so if you want to go ahead and book a party for September I will send you the fall and winter scents and you can start getting those September orders so um I do have the new catalog, so there's a little peek at the front. My VIPs have already seen it. If you um, want to be a part of my VIP group, you can see where I flip through the catalog just for them. Um, that is connected to my Facebook page, so um, if you go to my Facebook page, you can actually click on the groups tab and join the VIP group. Um, I do announce sometimes I will announce some personal specials in there um, you know just send me a request and I will get you in that group um, the other thing uh, we have a lot of things being discontinued so I'm gonna leave the link to my discontinued um, items list in the comments below um, you do want to stock up now uh, August is 10% off month so any everything in the catalog on the website they're all 10% off except for licensed products so that would be our, our NCAA warmers which are our like helmet warmers and little night college nightlight warmers um, our MLB warmers are not 10% off and then any of our cause products uh, like you see oh, wrong <laughs> Bernie right back here we love Bernie he is our autism bunny or bunny buddy <laughs> we love him because we are an autism family um he's not 10 percent off because he's a cause product but he is heavily discounted so you can get him for far below retail um 
Sebastian, the super buddy, he is not 10% off because he is a cost product and our Love Heals Warmer is not 10% off. And then we have a combine and save. I know one combine and save that is not 10% off. Um, I'll tell you real quick which one that one is too. Um, but everything else is 10% off. So you're going to want to stock up for one of two reasons. Um, let's see. Okay, so the Scentsy Companion System and the Perfect Scentsy these two because they have stars beside them they are not 10 percent off but everything else is like even our other combiner saves you know they're combiner saves on cleaning products laundry products bars uh scent circles all that stuff um you can get bars right now for 22.50 for a six pack so that's like 375 a bar so you got you want to stock up before the scents discontinue and you also want to stock up and this is the first time i've announced this um you may have seen it in other places but our bars our bars have been five dollars for 13 years now they are going up in the states i don't know about other countries they are going up to six dollars a bar but hey that is a buck that's that's not that much if you love your wax that's not going to bother you um i don't I don't think that's going to be an issue with customers. I think you guys will be fine with it because you love your wax and it lasts a long time. And comparing our wax to others, it it's a lot better quality. So, um, you know, what's one dollar? And you got to think about it. Thirteen years, it stayed at the same price. So um, we will. St so one bar will be six dollars. There will be no more three packs. We will now have a twin pack of the same scent. Now, that's okay too because a lot of times people will say, oh, you know, like for me, I have one cube left. If I would have bought a twin pack, I'd have a backup, but I don't. So good thing this is coming back because I do like this one. Um, but you know, that kind of prevents you from saying, you know, wanting to hoard that last cube. <laughs> um, you know, so you get them in twin packs. They're eleven dollars, so you're saving a dollar, which that I think that works out better. And you can always, you know, mix and match with friends. So if you have a friend that, you know, wants you guys want you want one of a bar, she wants one of a bar, and then there's another scent that each of you want. You can each buy a twin pack and then switch off the other two. So, um, and then of course, we're still going to have our six pack of bars. It's going to still equal out to be buy five, get one free. So it'll be $30 for a six pack now in September. Um, but that's, you know, and our combine and saves will now be bundle and saves, but there is a lot. There's a lot of awesome things coming in September. Our Scentsy Go. I'm really excited about Scentsy Go. And as soon as I get one, I know a lot of you have probably seen it already because you've seen um, the consultants who went to Scentsy Family Reunion did get one. Um, but it's, I did not attend, so I have to wait with the rest of you guys and get mine on September 1st. So I would will leave a link. I have a link um, that you can pre-order. So you can go ahead get your you know let me know how many scents he goes you want you can let me know how many uh which scents they do come in 15 different scents and i have them listed on that um form so those are all of the scents and they're 15 of our fake you know favorite scents um so you can go to that link pre-order and then on september 1st i will at at the you know at 3 a.m. <laughs> I will be up putting all those orders in and that way you can get your Scentsy Go as quick as possible also. Um, also, what else? Joining. I know I've already said it too. This is the best time to join. Um, normally, you pay $99 for a kit when you join and you get whatever that current season's testers and catalogs are. When you join in transition month, which is now, oh, I just stepped on something. Uh, when you join in August, you are not only going to get the spring and summer scents, uh, scent testers and catalogs and, you know, uh, product list and everything. You're going to get the fall and winter stuff. So our amazing company says, hey, you're joining our company. We're not going to make you turn around and less than 30 days later, go buy all new, uh, you know, business materials. Instead, they said, hey, we're going to throw it into that same kit that's still 
that's wonderful. It's amazing. Um, being a part of Sensi is so awesome. I would have never made videos before this. It has boosted my confidence so much. Um, we're able to bring in a little extra income for our family. We can, you know, I can pitch in and help my husband with bills, but I can also stay home with our kids. Um, like I said, we're an autism family. I like being able to be home for my little guy in the afternoons if he needs me. Um, I, you know, I love that we can, you know, I, I have a kiddo in travel ball, so I, that this can help you know, pay for that. So if you have kids in sports and you think, oh man, sports are just so hard to pay for um, with our regular income, you know, try joining Sensi and bringing in an extra couple hundred dollars a month to pay for those um, expenses for extracurriculars for your kids. Um, going back to the kit, we also, this month only, we have an enhanced kit. So you'll get the same $99 kit with spring and summer and fall and winter items but you're also going to get our beautiful beautiful entice diffuser and i will show you that diffuser it is so gorgeous it's like stained glass and it is handmade just like all of our other warmers here is that diffuser and you'll see it that's the color it is with the lights off um and it still has those you know 16 led lights it's back, you know, backed up with a lifetime warranty. I don't think there's any other uh, diffusers out there with a lifetime warranty. But that is a $130 value. And you get a natural oil valued at um, $10. So between the diffuser and the oil, that's $140. The kit uh, that you get is our $99 kit with this, and it's all $149. So you're getting the diffuser and the oil, and then you're getting your kit for only nine dollars more can't beat that you get it you know getting a beautiful diffuser an amazing oil and starting your own business for nine bucks so you don't really have much to lose there and uh, i would love to be your consultant um when you join you not only get everything that comes in your kit i mean there's a bunch of stuff that comes in there you're going to also get help from me i would love to help you out and mentor you and you know help you you know sit down and make a plan and figure out what you want to do with your business whether it's just making money or if you want to earn our amazing seven night mediterranean cruise um that is awesome too because joining in august we just kicked off our incentive period for our trip and what's great about sensi is you can be way down here and earn the trip or you can be at the top and earn the trip and it's actually easier when you're starting out to earn these trips because you get extra points for promoting and when you're way at the top you can't promote anymore so when you're starting out at the bottom you're able to promote multiple times in the trip incentive period um, when you hit your sensational start you get bonus points so so many bonus points are available for new consultants and I think that's awesome I love that anybody and everybody can earn these trips and I would love to have you on that boat with me I am determined to earn this I have never been outside the United States and I think it'd be so much fun to go on that cruise so let's go on the cruise together and <laughs> so if you would like to join our team I will leave the join link I also you know like I said you can message me on Facebook if you don't have Facebook you can email me I'm gonna leave my email address too but I have made this video super long, so let's hope it actually processes like it's supposed to this time. Um, and with that being said, I hope you all have a great rest of your weekend, and um, I will see you soon. Bye. Mm -hmm.